One of the biggest struggles that we've got here at TMS, and you see this on our Facebook page all the time, like us on Facebook, is convincing people that digital to analog converters, DACs, make a difference to your sound. There are loads of people out there who think that uh, the conversion chips in your phone or your laptop or your tablet or whatever are almost indistinguishable from an external one, like this, uh, the JDS Labs OL DAC. Um, and their argument is based on the fact that they can't hear a difference. The problem is the difference is there. External DACs and, you know, more expensive external DACs do change the sound a little bit. They make the conversion a little bit smoother. They don't add to the sound, they simply remove the noise and the jitter and the artifacts that you're likely to get when digital ones and zeros are converted to analog sound. So yes, there is a difference. Please stop saying there isn't. This isn't like the cable debate where maybe there is, maybe there isn't, no one's quite sure. Nope, Dax, there's a difference. You just gotta listen to it. That being said, it's a subtle difference. And as much as I love the OL DAC from JDS, it's definitely not gonna convince people. This is a DAC that costs about $140. It is exceptionally simple. Uh, it's got two inputs, an optical and a USB input. You plug it in, you select your input, you're connected to your amp, preferably this this guy, uh, the O2 headphone amplifier, also by JDS. Look, they stack together, it's very cool. Man, it was tough to, to see the difference this made to the sound. I, I'm sure it was there, because I'm pretty sure that what has gone into this is, is better than uh, the, the, uh, the conversion chips in, in my laptop. But all the same, I would be lying if I said I could hear a major difference. This is a DAC. It's not a good DAC, it's not a bad DAC, it's just a DAC. And if you want an external DAC, this is an okay place to start. And I feel really bad about this. It, it's built well, it works well, it does its job, but the difference is exceptionally subtle. I like to think that like, my ears are, are okay and I can I pick up the differences with, with different DACs, but I was doing a couple of blind tests between this and my laptop and yeah, there were a few times where I was like, I genuinely can't hear a difference. It's extremely subtle. Do I recommend it? Look, if you need a DAC, it's a perfectly good one. It's a little bit expensive, I think, but uh, as DACs go, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. It's not gonna match something like a benchmark DAC 3, which we reviewed a while back, but it will get the job done. This is the JDS Labs OL DAC. This, this channel you're watching is the master switch. My name is Rob. Full thoughts in the description below, little linky link to our website with a full review. And like always, please subscribe. And yeah, like us on Facebook.